Hello everybody, welcome back to the Afterbirth Greed Mode series. We are on to Judas. Let's see what we can do. Let's see if we can put together another win. I do like Judas. Uh, they did debuff the Book of Belial, but they didn't debuff the damage, which is interesting. I'm going to take this damage. I'm sorry, health. Uh, we have high damage, uh, low health with Judas. That's the uh, caveat for playing Judas. Um, but like I said, Book of Belial is here. Yes, it did get a debuff, but the debuff is not dam not damage related. It is related to deal with the devil, I believe. Uh, wow, I almost stepped on that spike. Like, really, really close to stepping on that spike. Um, but yeah, we should be good. The, the Book of Belial play is kind of interesting in green mode because it lasts the whole time uh, of the wave, which is weird. But I guess by design, that's that's how it's supposed to be. I talked a little bit about it when I did my Judas run on Twitch, which actually I uploaded my YouTube. Which I did some readjustments of the thumbnails and the episode numbers because I want that to be something different. Like something that's from my stream. That's a stream highlight. Uh, and that could have its own episode numbers, you know? if it, it No matter what the, the game mode is, if it's a stream highlight, it's a stream highlight. And it'll just go into... Uh, concurrently go into the episode you know the next episode of whatever the stream highlight is at currently that made no sense um i really don't want to die here so i'm gonna pay attention a little bit because i got a bullet dodge here seems like a bunch of little guys uh there's another horde coming in don't want to die here so let's make sure no champions jump out at us um but yeah i did a little readjusting of the thumbnails I really like the new green mode thumbnails. Cryptic Romeo did the the, uh, the base art for it. I just did like the text overlays, and actually threw coins on my eyes for the green mode thumbnails. And then for like the normal thumbnails, they'll just be different variations. And if I do a daily series, you know, so on and so forth. Uh, so it looks like we could probably buy a key here. Everything else is not doing it for me. Let's just see what's in our item room. Um, that is Cancer. I didn't pick that up last run because I thought it was Virgo and I was too scared, but that's okay. Uh, we ended up winning last run, spoiler alert. So I really want to reroll these. Uh, let's actually go in here since we got the health up. Okay, so we have three more cents. That's actually really good because I want to reroll these and maybe buy... I'm going to buy this because it's damage and health. Uh... As Judas, that's just perfect, you know? That's just what we need. A little bit of health, a little bit of damage on top of our already nice damage uh, starting stat. It's good. It's good, man. Feels real good. Judas, by the way, probably my favorite character. Uh, and when I say that, I, dis I don't include uh, Isaac or Eden um, when I say favorite character, because I just don't... I don't know. Isaac's... Isaac's my favorite on the contingency that he has a D6. Uh, and then Eden is my favorite, but Eden is, is literally the most random character. So Eden is my favorite character to play. Favorite character in the game is Judas, for sure. I just like everything about him. Uh, I like the Book of Belial. Uh, even with the debuff, I still, I, I like the idea. The thing is, I don't think, I don't know why they got rid of like, they shouldn't have got rid of the 100, or they, could have gotten rid of the 100% devil deal chance, but I hope they didn't like get rid of all the percentage. Like if you're holding the Book of Belial, I think you should have a higher percentage of getting a devil deal. Um, I don't think it should be 100% like a uh, goat head or anything, but yeah, I don't know. That doesn't sit well with me. I hope they didn't get rid of all the percentage. Even if it's a little percent, that's still cool. Um, but Judas still remains my favorite. Just, just everything about him. Cosmetically, I like his Fez cap hat thing. Um, I like the idea of a of a, a glass cannon type character where low health, high damage. It's right up my alley. Uh, Leech, I'm taking this for deal with the devil precedent. Um, I don't want to run into any angel deals. I could get a soul heart. I'm gonna. I don't know why I prefaced that with could if I knew I was gonna grab it. Let's go on. Let's move on. I like where we're at. Um, let's check what our free item room is. It's another health up, which I, it's okay. I mean, I think I'm good on health right now. 
I would like some uh, tier stats, like a tier tiers up. We got some damage ups, but let's see what's in here. Nun's habit. Looks like I'm gonna have to try to re-roll that. Let's buy a key. Let's see if we could hit this. <laughs> Didn't re-roll the items. It's all good. Okay. Eight inch nails. I'm very excited about this. The only time I've had eight inch nails, I had Ludovico technique. Every time it's bad. These aren't piercing. Now that, that is very surprising. So the only time I've had these, I had Ludovico technique and I was like just basically pushing around a nail, which was really cool, but I don't think it did the item justice. I'm still like shocked that it doesn't pierce. Am I alone on that? Isn't that weird? That it doesn't pierce? Oh, sorry. Should have done this a while ago. Did it add blood to the nails? Oh my god, if it did, that's so cool. Um, I gotta wait to not have uh, Book of Belial on me to see if there's still blood on the nails. That would be really cool, though. Maybe that's just that's just like if you it, like the same thing when your tears turn red. Maybe that's what happens. The there gets blood on the edge of the nail. Either way, this is a badass item. I'm enjoying this. Uh, it's very satisfying when you hit an enemy, especially when they die one hit. Hitting these guys making me feel like I'm popping a balloon or something. I kind of like it though. Not gonna lie. Um. All right. So we will see the non-Book of Belial technique, or <laughs> technique, geez, yeah, it doesn't have a red tip. So I'm assuming it's the same thing when your tears, you know, turn red. Uh, please, re-roll, sir, what? Hello? Okay. Okay, we do have Black Candle, which, I mean, I'm not thrilled about, but we could buy it now. A little concerned about how many times it took to reroll the shop items. Makes me scared to try to do it again. I guess I could try to do it when I get down to 15 cents. I could settle for something like the black handle. Gertie Jr. Hello, my friend. How are you? How are you on this fine day? Uh, oh, God. So, it doesn't pierce, but it seems like when an enemy's charging and you hit him with the... Is it 9-inch nails or 8-inch nails? I know Nine Inch Nails would be a play on the band, probably. Um, but yeah, it seems to not pierce, but it seems to, like, not knock back either, but, like, halt enemies if they are charging you, which is cool. I dig it. I dig it. I can't help but think these would be awesome with piercing shot, though. You know what I'm saying? Little Sagittarius, little, uh... What's the other one? Is it just piercing shot? The one with like the uh, headdress, when you wear the headdress? I'm really questionably bad at dodging those shots. I, I need to get better because I see this guy a lot. I don't know why it's so, it, it makes, it seems difficult for me. It, it's not a difficult dodge. I just gotta grow up, I think. Rotten baby, easy grab. Easy freaking grab. So I guess, I mean, Black Candle's good, man, but let's try to get greedy. All right, that's a lot of health right there. Plus, we'll wear cute pajamas. Oh, God, he's so cute with those nails in his head. We look so sick right now. Um. Okay, all right. Well, I guess let's move on. There's nothing really uh, he could give me. I mean, he can give me health, I guess, but do you think he'll give it to me in five cents? I don't. I want to hang on to five cents so I can buy a key and open up the item room straight off the bat. You know what I'm saying, dog? And we save two cents. Sorry. Yes, we save two cents by buying it for three cents. I believe this is a both spacebar items, I'm thinking. Okay, so this gives us a black heart, and it gave us four bombs. It's not... Okay, I'm happy that it's a passive item. I'm very happy. Let's just open up that, just in case maybe we get a little key. Okay, not enough money. 
but we'll uh, hopefully eventually get a key. Let's check in here. Three more cents. So we could buy a key and open up one of the chests. Is it worth it? Probably not. Able. Easy carry. Easy carry. All right, let's hit this button. Let's get on. Let's get on with it. Book of Belial. It would be really cool if these tiers got bigger and were really fast. Oh, that was dumb. It looks like it almost has an area of effect, like when you hit, like see the little things that come out? It looks like it hurts everything in the area, which could be really cool. I think it does, because I, I was blatantly hitting the wall by that guy and it was hurting him, but it doesn't seem to be getting around these guys' freaking skulls. I thought he triggered me. Oh, triggered, dude, triggered. See, like, I completely halted his, uh, charge there. Okay, alright, I'm happy these guys aren't brimstone. That could have been quite difficult. Kills those guys really fast, too. Um, what's in here? What's in here? I mean, we'll get the key, I guess. This is probably not worth, but it could be Cricket's head. Bob's rotten head. Tried to... <laughs> tried to re-roll everything without spending a dime. Uh, I am gonna do this just because it might drop us a coin. It did not. Uh, that's okay. That's okay. Got a book of Belial here. All right, let's make sure not to leave because uh, I'm not gonna be able to book a Belial again before the uh, deal with the devil fight. This this boss is really grossing me out. I think his name's Brownie. I'm not sure. He is really gross. Our damage is not that good. Like, yeah, the nails are cool and everything, but <laughs> in the end, our damage isn't like staggering by any stretch. Uh, yeah, let's just hit it because, like I said, I don't want to leave and lose Book of Belial. Bomberman? Really, bro? Really? Burkano. Burkano. I just, like, knocked him into me. I really, I, I, I don't know when he is triggered and when he is not, but he goes so fast, I literally can't even hit him with my tears. Leech carry. The leech carry right now. I don't know. I don't know if I was hitting him at all or if that was all leech or what. Definitely taking ceremonial robes. That's gonna bring me right back. Let's see what these pills do. Bad trip. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Hematemesis. Hematemesis. Okay. Um, kind of need like tears up right now, like in a really kind of a bad way. I don't want to re-roll the run just because I really like the nails. I mean, lump of coal could add range. I don't know if it synergizes well. Didn't look like it added any range, really. But we're going to live with it because we freaking purchased it. Um, let's hope we can get a tears up here. Like, I kind of really need one. There's a tinted rock there. That's a range up? Yeah, and a tears up. Okay, a tears up. All right, Mr. Dolly. Oh, man, that might have been just what we needed. That looks crazy. Is there a key on sale? There's not a key on sale. Can you drop a drop a coin for me for ya? Oh, thank you very much. Darling. All right. Um. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, so we got Polly. Um, things just got just zero to 100 real quick. As the great Aubrey Drake Drizzy Rider said, zero to 100 real quick. That's also piercing shots. 
Okay. Maybe some of the... <laughs> maybe some of these enemies will blow that thing up. So these tiers are pretty ridiculous. And not only that, our rotten baby flies are just insane. They just hit very hard. Really thought I was gonna one-shot that. We as a character are pretty slow, but that's okay. We can't really complain. We just got Polly and we have these uh, eight inch nails. I mean, these, these uh, enemy spawns, I kind of want to complain about. Seems a little corny. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you. All right, so that was it for that. <sighs> that little wave there. Um, really would like torn photo. Really would like torn photo. I really don't think it's gonna happen though. Really don't, unless we get a lucky dime drop or something. Oh man, if I didn't get hit, I might have got a good enough money bonus to actually buy Torn Photo. That's even a thing. Okay, three cents. And I can't really leave this room because I really, really want to keep the Book of Belial thing. So we already killed one of them. I think we killed two of them? No. Still that one. He's low though. That was pretty simple. Let's see what you got for me. Krampus? I already have Lump of Coal, so that's kind of awk. Yeah, I'm not taking Krampus' head. Sorry. It's not happening. Oh, this is really unfortunate. We went to the curse room. Hmm. I mean, one of those plays could give you two cents, I think, but let's see if there's anything in here. Please, something. A nickel, nickel. Okay, all right, all right, all right. We're just gonna have to deal with no torn photo. It is what it is. Let's just look at it one more time and be sad. I could get PhD. Let's save our 11 cents for a rainy day. What do you say? What do you say, mate? What do you say? Um, little Steven, and let's see if we can get a key. It looks like this speed ball. Uh, let's go in here. Okay. Held down, perfect, and a bad trip. Wow, okay. Not the best. Uh, there is a blank card. We don't have a bomb. I didn't go into the item room. I'm a derp. I'm a derp. I'm a freaking derp. It's okay. It's all right, we don't need the item room just yet. We will. Oh, I didn't even do this, did I? I don't think I did. It's off. I really like these tiers. They look really badass. I'm not gonna lie about it. I'm getting hit by spiders. These guys shoot very fast, so you just gotta keep moving. My tiers will eventually hit them. Everything is gonna be all right. This last wave. Okay, let's see what the item room has. Kills heal. Uh, almost useless. Almost actually useless. We have 24 cents. Really don't need this pill at all. Speedball. We will take. There's no bomb. That's probably... Even if it's a joker, I don't think it really matters. Alright. Let's do this. Let's freaking do this. I really don't know where the other one is. There he is. 
At least I'm getting some practice here. Dodge these freaking tears. Is he? Does he get really vulnerable in that in that uh, state when he's doing those tears? Cause wow, wow, I killed him quick. Okay, it's a very simple boss. They're gonna be dead in a matter of seconds. Literally just the spiders left. Two black hearts. Uh, let's see what's up here. Can't reroll. Damage clot. Yeah, it is a damage up. I'm okay with it. I really like the little thing that the nails make when they hit that little burst. I like that graphic. It's nice and uh, simple. Okay, there's a reroll in here. There's a chest. Uh, we don't have enough for even a key. Let's see what this has in store for us. Luck. Health up. Health up. Okay. Let's move on here. I ran, I ran over the spike. I didn't mean to do that. I think every time I actually like stop the waves, it's on it's on accident of me like accidentally running over the. I just took three hits in a matter of like twelve seconds. It's really bad. Quite embarrassing. I really like those new mom hands. They are challenging. And a little scary. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This is all good. This is all good. Trigger them. Get behind them. It's so weird that the freaking noose ends. I didn't think that through. Okay. Um... Check out what the shop has. I can reroll. I still don't... That's like a... It's like almost like a peep. A peeper thing where it goes back and forth. Um... We'll just take safety pin. Mom's key appeared. It's like almost like a peeper thing where it bounces back and forth, but it looks like a missing number kind of thing. It's like a glitch in the game. I don't really know what it does. I'm assuming it just deals damage when it runs over enemies, but I don't know. I did have it in a greed run. I don't think I had it for very long though. If I'm being straight up, the poly poly uh, eight inch nails synergy didn't. I didn't. It didn't. I don't know. I had. I guess I had a little higher expectations for the synergy, and it's just. It's just uh, okay. It's not amazing. I was expecting like huge nails that would like pierce the target. I don't know, dude. I don't know. No, I mean, that's going to make us lose our nails. How cool would it be if they changed them into spinning nails? Oh, that was MLG. Um, I mean, I'll take it. I mean, rip the nails, but... I think we had to do it. I think we had to do it, mate. Oh! What? 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 Oh, and there's a bomb right here? What is happening? Do they really want me to go down here? Three coins. <laughs> All that for three freaking coins? That's all right. It's better than zero coins, I guess. So what do we have? What are, what are we on right now? Are we on the shop? Are we going to fight this uh, mf -er right now? I think we are. I think we freaking are. So, and okay, we can get a key for free right here. A key for free. That's a damage up. The damage freaking up. Uh, I would like to get lucky or tooth shot, whatever it is. But it might be in our best interest. Just, I mean, we can't really do anything about it. So let's just get a soul heart and then another soul heart, and that's that. And that's that's freaking that. Maybe a GG. Maybe a freaking GG, boys. 
I don't know. I don't know. Just the last time we had, uh... The last time we had Death's Touch going into this fight, it was easy peasy. Granted, we won Shot Green, or Monstro last time, but whatever. Yeah, we are not doing half the damage that we were doing that last run, or not last run, last time we had Death's Touch in here. But it's still great. The big uh, hitbox is really what makes it. I don't. Th I think the death touch is like the freaking ultra greed killer. It's easy peasy, man. I know it sounds crazy, but I think they could have made this fight harder. Uh, maybe not. Maybe it's just because I don't care that I'm spending money because it's not like I'm donating it to anything. The risk reward doesn't seem like it's there. It just seems like, especially with the 109 cap, and I think that's a temporary thing until you figure out how to like break that threshold. I don't really know, but it just seems like it doesn't matter if I come down here with zero cents. And in that just le lends itself to me buying whatever items I want and making this fight very, very, very easy. Now, let me tell you that one episode, that stream highlight that I have up on my YouTube, um, that with Judas, that was really difficult. Not only because it was one of the first times I ever fought this boss, but my damage was not good because I was so worried about bringing down money. I literally had 99 cents and I was like, I'm not, I want to bring all this money down and donate it all to the machine. And I brought 99 cents down and obviously when I tr got to 109, it blew up, but, um, that was cool because I was like, dude, I can't spend this money. I really want to dump some money in. Let's see how little we could buy and still beat Ultra Greed. That to me was what this mode was all about when I heard about it, but it doesn't seem that way. I mean, un like I said, un until somebody figures out what the deal with the greed donation machine is, it, this mode just seems like uh, a little too easy for my taste, but it's fun. Like, it's fun seeing all the new items, and it's fun playing a new game mode in Isaac. Um, but yeah, uh, until next time, we will be playing as Blue Baby, which would which should be interesting. A lot of people seem to struggle with Blue Baby. We'll see how we can do on the uh, Greed Run in the next episode. But until then, stay safe, stay up, and peace out.